Let's look at the integral 1 over square root e to the power 2x minus 25. We're going to factor e to the power 2x and then put a 1 here to get that. Minus 2, uh, minus 25 times e to the power negative 2x times this, you get e to the power 0, which is 1. 1 times 25 is 25, okay? So bring this out, you get e to the power 2x to the power half. And then the remainder here is square root 1 minus 25 e to the power 2x. And then uh, 2 and 2 cancel, you get e to the power x, square root 1 minus 25 e to the power negative 2x. 1 over e to the power 2x is e to the power negative x, dx. And then you can uh, write this as a square, it would be 5 times e to the power negative x square. 5 square is 25, e to the power negative x square, it will be e to the power negative 2x. Now we can push this into dx, the derivative e to the power negative x is e to the power, ne e to the power negative x times the derivative of negative x is negative 1, negative 1 cancel with that, e to the power negative x dx. So this is this, minus 1 out, and then you have integral of d, e to the power negative x square root 1 minus 5, e to the power negative x square. This is nothing more than arc sine of this. Check the coefficient in front of e to the power of negative x, 1 here, 5 here. They are different. Therefore, we need to correct by dividing by 5 and 4 plus c. Done. Thank you for watching. Hope video is informative, helpful. Before you go, make sure to subscribe, share, comment, and don't forget to hit or smash the like button. See you.